If you're looking for a room tour of the water villas at San Siam Oluwele in Maldives, then you're in the right place. Hi, I'm Pooja from Color Me in Style. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Once you arrive at the resort, you will be checked in and you will be assigned a concierge. Um, this lovely lady here is taking us to our water villa. So if you booked the deluxe water villa like us, then you will need to walk to um, the villas because they are in a part where the buggies don't go. These are the older construction villas, but they are equally beautiful and um, the walk, as you can see here, is quite scenic and it's not that long. Six to ten minutes tops. Also, just look at how blue this water is. This is because it is a lagoon and these are water villas over the lagoon so you can easily swim in it the kids can go in it quite easily and uh, when i show you the ocean water villas you will see the difference in color of the water it's slightly darker and the obviously because it's the ocean the sea can be a bit rough Right then, let's get into it and check out the deluxe water villa at San Siam Oluwele. These are the sunrise water villas and if you have a bit more budget handy, then go for the sunset water villas. However, I do like the view from the bathroom in the sunrise water villas more. So as you come in, you have a little hallway with some storage. Then here's your bedroom with a desk, uh, two side tables, the standard stuff. The beds were comfy and the pillows were great too. Then you have your tea coffee station. You also get complimentary water which gets replenished every single day. Under the TV you have your mini bar and there's a single bed in the corner for my little one. Also this is one of the few resorts that allows children under the age of 12 on a water villa. So again quite a spacious room as you can see. You also have a nice sitting sofa that looks out into the lagoon. Now let's check out the other areas. So this is your dressing room and you've got quite a lot of wardrobe space and mirrors, a long mirror and a small one, vanity mirror. This is where we basically just dumped our luggage as well. Now let's check out the best part of this villa, the bathroom. So as you walk in, you have your toilet to the left and a shower to the right with all the supplies. There's um, a sink on both sides and you have your towels and things. Uh, you also get your beach towels at the bottom there. And here is the bathtub with a view. The sunrise water villas face some of the other villas in the background, but you can't see what other people are doing. But it's just, um, you get this lovely island view as well. Now, this is the outside. You have your jacuzzi there. You have your sunbeds here. And on the deck, you also have your breakfast table. You also have an entry to your bedroom and also to the bathroom and now you can get down here to go into the lagoon and have a swim at night you can spot a lot of fishes over here who get attracted to the light and um, it's really really soothing to watch so yeah we are so so happy with our room let me take you swimming now 
this is us in the afternoon and as you can see I can just walk in the water and little ones enjoying herself as well now let's check out a sunrise from the deck Now, these are the basic water villas that you can get at this resort. They don't have a jacuzzi or a pool, but they have a great view and access to the beach. This is what it looks like from the inside, and it's a pretty budget-friendly water villa. Now it's time for the grand water villas on Dream Island. These are newer built and you can see how high the water is here. So this is what the room actually looks like from the inside. And here is what the outside deck looks like. So on Dream Island, parallel to the Grand Water Villas, you have the Grand Water Villas with pool. This is what it looks like from the inside. So not much difference apart from space, but you'll be paying more for this deck. With the swimming pool, this is the selling point of this villa. This property occupies two adults, two children or three adults only. There's also a double occupancy romantic water villa on the Dream Island, uh, perfect for honeymooners. And it comes with a pool, so those floating breakfast mornings are very much possible. If your party size is six adults or four adults and two children, then the presidential water suite is right for you. It's the biggest water suite that they have and I believe there are two of them on site and these are on the main island. It's got two bedrooms, two bathrooms and a large living room with uninterrupted lagoon views. And this is what the outside looks like with your own pool and a beautiful deck with lagoon views. Overall, Stansiam Oluveli offers a range of water villas for every budget. If you want to know what it's actually like to live in Stansiam Oluveli, definitely go and check out my Maldives vlog. For now, this is Pooja signing off from Colour Me In Style. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel so that I can bring you some more amazing destinations and fashion. Bye bye!